moment I've got my camera facing backwards and remounted to the side of the helmet and uh, I've got it connected to my phone so I can actually see what it is that's being recorded behind me which is a neat little aspect I've never explored that avenue before so uh, I've got a nice view of my rear seat on the bike and uh, plus everything beyond that so uh, it's looking quite good actually there you know, the camera mounted on top of the left hand mirror uh, although it was an unobstructed view of uh, what was ahead of me uh, a little bit of vibration in the mirror um, particularly anything above 60 kilometers an hour and it was there was too much vibration with it so um, I decided to scrap that idea of mounting it on the, on the mirror and, uh, Although, uh, I did have it uh, on the mirror yesterday at one point, uh, driving around town and riding. Uh, it was actually uh, pretty good at a maximum of 60 kilometers an hour, no vibration. And it worked quite well. The worst thing was that you could actually see me. But, uh, but on the plus side, I had a helmet on, so there was nothing that uh, was scary for the kids to look at. So now I'm just having a, a trial run around some of the roads that I know and, and then download this video when I get home again to see what it looks like on the big screen TV. Having the camera mounted on the, on the mirror was also disappointing in that uh, there is a microphone in the camera and uh, it just picked up all wind noise whereas having the, the camera mounted to the helmet I can plug the microphone directly into the into the camera where the uh, the mouthpiece for the microphone is directly in front of me in the, in the chin guard so there's no wind noise strange thing about um, looking at the camera mounted as I've got it at the moment on the helmet um, the camera looks as if it's actually pointing down to the ground but uh, it's been a little bit of trial and error as to the angle that I should have the camera at uh, with, with the helmet sitting on the table the camera seems to be pointing almost at 80 degrees down but when it's when the helmet's on my head uh, the angle seems to be okay
So another feature that um, I've noticed here, I can actually turn the recording on and off by just pushing the, uh, the record button again on the phone, and I don't have to mess about with the uh, with the slide on and off on the uh, camera itself.